Max Rush of Kindness. That should be fun. We have two more days of confidants before we have to send the calling card. Hi. All right, everyone, quiet down. I suggest you listen carefully. What do you want to do? All right, so let's read. Cool. We'll have a guts increase next time we uh, open a book. Probably should have read the other books because probably have. I want to get the trophy that where we can read all the books too. So hey. there's two days left. Make sure we use it wisely. You're right. Ryuji's not available. There's Takami. Okay, so we don't have anything. Shit. Hmm? So let's head up to the library and let's just read for now. Damn it. Ugh. Wanna head back? We're close, I can feel it. We're close, I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. Enough to make my systems blow. All these guys are just like, oh, Phantom Thieves, we gotta get them killed, we gotta get them arrested. Blah, 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 blah. That kind of shit. What else is new? Ah, you're back. No. Ryuji, we'll do that later. Church today. Alright, so Sojo's not available, so we don't have to worry about that. But Hifumi is available, so let's go force an ST real quickly. Damn it, it's still an ST. Oh well. Alright, so unfortunately it didn't work, so let's just go have an ST with Hifumi. I should have used that for guts, my bad. Oh wait, I'm still good. So Hifumi my- So I changed my mind. We're gonna do the Big Bang Challenge again and increase our guts. Oh my god, we're close. I can One feel it. Back. I can feel it. We are close. We are close. Alright. 17th. The last day of confidence before we head into the palace and finish this. <clears throat> hey! All right. Hey. All right. Hey. All right. Hey. Hey. All right. Alright, so nothing happened, unfortunately. But I did read through all the guides and shit, so that's good. Alright, we'll go everyone, over. open your textbooks to page whatever. Something about math and shit. Hey, Amamiya. Give me an answer. Which of these? The snail. The snail. The snail is B. This is it. Precise. Good job. You're not stupid. Good job. That's awesome. Nice going. Alright. Since I have plenty of yen, I want to do a round quick book book buy real quickly. Hey, I'll be right back. All right, so I just went ahead and got the trophy drink fanatic. I bought every single type of uh, drink that you can get. So what we're gonna do now is we are going to wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. I want to do Shinya's. Makoto's is available. We'll be fine. Um, I'll probably regret it later, but we'll be fine. Alright, so let's talk to Shinya. Hey! 
Mami-san, hey, listen. Let's do it. Let's hang out with Shinya. <laughs> yeah, come with me. Hey! They did it! The Phantom Thieves did it! <laughs> my mom really did have a change of heart. When I got home, my mom cooked dinner. She made my favorite hamburger steak. Then she admitted that she was wrong and apologized for getting so mad about everything. Then she broke down... Then she broke down crying and told me that she'll be a better mother from now on. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah! It's all thanks to the Phantom Thieves, and you, Amamiya-san. Actually... I guess winning and losing doesn't matter when it comes to just being happy. Well, it's true, isn't it? The reason my mom was able to change is because you lost to the Phantom Thieves. Losing wasn't... wasn't the end at all. It brought my real mom back. Man, I'm so happy right now. Am I weird for feeling happy about losing? I mean, all I cared about was before was winning. It means you've matured. Huh? Really? Well, you may be right. Looking back at how obsessed I was with winning, I could see I was just acting like a kid. I want to get stronger. Strong enough so I can protect my mom. I was realizing something from you and the Phantom Thieves. Instead of destroying others, protecting and saving people is what makes a person strong. You listen to my problems and even confronting my mom for me. I, I guess it was pretty cool of you. Ugh. Rank 9, baby, of the Tower Arcana. Alright. Nothing yet, but we'll get something hey. soon. By the way, do you remember... Taki Kumu, the pro who beat me? I heard more rumors that he uses illegal armor. I wonder why he's cheating. He wants to win at all costs. Uh-huh. Yeah, I kind of understand how he feels. I might have cheated too if I had known how. <laughs> but I don't feel that way at all anymore. Okay, I'm gonna head home. Hey, Amamiya-san. Are the Phantom Thieves... Never mind. Bye! Yeah, give me that kindness! Damn it. I tried. Alright. Alright, this is the last confidant that I can do before going into the palace. Well then. Tomorrow's the day. Once you send the calling card, there's no turning back. Make sure you're finishing preparations tonight. Sojo is available for an ST. So let's go to the red light district real quick. Let's see if we can't change that. that sure is something. Um, what shall we do? There we go. Sojuro is available for another increase. Once again, I want to get Sojuro as high as I can because uh, I've been ignoring him the whole game, and he's only up and he's only up to rank four. So we're gonna head back to Cas Cafe Leblanc and we're gonna hang out with Sojuro. Let's do it. Hang out. Help him All out. All right then. Hey, thanks. Futaba's coming to eat today too. I'll get the curry ready. I'm leaving the coffee to you. <laughs> Phew! I'm wicked full. How was the curry, Futaba? Delicious. I'm gonna I'm gonna be dreaming of that stuff tonight. Um, did it taste the same as you remember it? Yep. I felt I feel like a dummy for not not wanting to eat it back when I was depressed about my mom. Oh, that's right. Oh yeah, the first episode of the brand new anime. I want to watch it. I want to watch it. I want to watch is airing tonight. I'm out of here. Good lord. Eyes in front of when you walk, okay? No spacing out. You, ri you ran head first into a pole last time you went for a walk. Well, you stubbed your toe on the dresser that other day. Oh crap, it's gonna start. Making like a leaf and... Now oh, screw it. Bye! <laughs> I'm 
She thought it was delicious. What about you? I think I'm addicted. Really? I guess it, you have pretty good taste if you can understand how incredible curry, curry is. Now then, there's something I should probably tell you. Here, take a seat. I'll pour you some coffee. Yeah. Remember how I said the recipe for this curry was developed by a scientific genius? You may have realized by now, but that genius was Futaba's mo mother, Wakaba. In other words, that, that curry is one of the last remaining connections Futaba has with her mom. I first met Wakaba back back when I was doing work for the government. She was in real tr she was real trouble, let me tell you. Logic prevailed over emotion for her, and she had an intricate knowledge of the human mind. I thought my pickup lines were the best in town, but not a single one worked on her. <laughs> uh, bu 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 she wasn't normal, huh? You can probably get a good idea just from looking at Futaba. Wakaba was the adult was like the adult version of that. It was almost impossible to keep up with her. Men are idiots though. We spend our time chasing after things we can't get. Wakaba rejected me time and time again, but there was one instance I managed to surprise her. And that was when I gave her a, a plate of my homemade curry. The very next day she came asking about the ingredients and wanted and what goes into the cooking process. Then, just a few days later, she handed me a scientifically enhanced version of my recipe. It was incredible. She had used my curry as the basics, and it, and it was miles better than anything I made. Curry was Wakaba's, spe Wakaba's specialty from then on. Naturally, Futaba grew to love it in no time as well. But then, after Wakaba's incident, Futaba stopped eating it entirely. The flavor would make her remember the pain. I even, I even heard... I've heard even smells can even bring back memories, too. But that curry was the only point of connection I had with Futaba. That's why I wanted. That's why I took her in. I vowed to keep this recipe alive until she could eat it again. It really paid off in the end. Yeah, I felt like it was a huge weight was lifted off my so shoulders when she said it was delicious. The whole idea of pairing the curry with a nice brew is thanks to Wakaba's refinement, too. Despite how introverted she she seemed she was extraordinarily perceptive of other people around her i never even told her about my love for coffee she figured it it was it out just from looking at me that was when i realized she was totally out of my league not when i really not like i really stood a chance but to begin with i already had futaba by then after all this might seem like an old curry at to most people, but there's tons of emotions crammed inside. So, uh, make sure you keep the tradition going. Heck yeah. Rank 5 of the Hierophant Arcana. Alright, <laughs> All right, that's enough for tonight. Things are getting downright sappy here. Futaba's waiting for me at home, so I should probably be heading back. The rest is on you. Make sure you clean up before you go to bed. Yeah! Not quite yet. All right. Eventually. I have one more rank before that. Hoping I can do it. The 18th is finally here, ladies and gentlemen. Pay attention. Hey, quit sleeping over there. Jeez, you look like a bunch of fucking dead fish. Was that a phone that I saw? Blah 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 blah. Uh, mommy and son, are you awake? Look at this map. Give me just a minute, Mr. Teacher, so I can get my fucking cheat sheet out. Why don't you try? Where's the, 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 the summit of Mount Fuji? This is it. I'm not asleep, see? Exactly. See? Yeah, exactly. I'm not asleep. Nice going. What'd I miss? Okay. Rank max. We'll show you who's just. The fan site's on fire as usual. Anyways, tomorrow's finally it. I hope everyone remembers. The date of our plan? Of course you remember. That means we're sending the calling card today, right? Yes, today is our only option. The police have yet to actually make a move, but I am certain we have reached our limits. We won't have to wait as long as possible to make Makoto's sister panic, right? Yes, taking into into account today would be the best option. We can speak in more detail of this after school. I will tell Akechi Kun as well. All right, see y'all at Leblon. <laughs> Boss said he reserved the.
place just for us. We're free to drink as much coffee as we want. Ain't this place always empty, though? I'm telling boss. <laughs> huh? Everyone here is a witness. Uh, uh I, I was just joking. Um, we're supposed to be discussing where we should send the calling card. Considering how big the hype's gotten, she'll probably just think it's a prank, won't she? I could always put it on Sai San's desk. People know me there, so I could gain access easily. That's not a good idea. If you're the only one who can get in there, it'll be easily traced back to you. I'll do it. I can just tell her it came for her in the mail. That would be the least risky method, no matter what she asks. I'll tell her I don't know anything. But Makoto, that's... You're our leader, so this will be up to you. Should we leave the calling card to Makoto? I trust her with it. Is that really the only way? Yes. I'll be okay. I've already traversed far more dangerous ground than this. We will leave it to you then. Thank you for agreeing to this. I will need to step up my game as well to make up for it. Very well then. We'll enter from in front of the courthouse. Does six o'clock in the evening work for everyone? Yep, got it. Same as always. Well then, let's get ready for tomorrow. Dismissed. Tomorrow's finally the day. All that's left is to carry out the operation that Makoto outlined earlier. Now then, we just need to hand it over, as long as we can get it to Nijima. Madame Sae Nijima, a great sinner of jealousy. You have lost yourself amidst your obsession with success. For its sake, you are even willing to promote injustice as justice. From the Phantom Thieves. I found it in our mailbox. To think they would send me one. They brand me a criminal and plan to change my heart? What nonsense. They only care about disposing of those who are an inconvenience for them. Fine. I'll just have to catch them first. And when you do, you're going to interrogate them, right? In some kind of underground room, was it? Why do you ask? Oh, I just remembered you mentioning something like that before. That's right. It will be in a special interrogation room underground. My time will be limited, but I will do whatever it takes to make them divulge their secrets. Let's do this fair and square. I should probably be getting back. It's late, but I should contact the director and let him know about this calling card. I expect things will calm down a little once this case is over. Once that happens, why don't we go on a trip to some hot springs? Just the two of us. Sis... I'm on your side. I won't let anyone do anything to you. <laughs> <laughs> What an odd girl. Do you need to make a call? I'll head up to my room then. I'm sorry for calling so late. This is Nijima. There's something I need to inform you of. I received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. It was addressed to me directly and... Stand by? And you've transferred command of the investigation to someone else? No, of course not. Yes. I understand. I'll remain on standby until further instructions. Please excuse me. What an ass- what assholes. Okay. Let's get to bed early, well rested and ready. Sorry- sorry for the wait. I believe it went well. Thanks, Mako-chan. It's all according to the game plan. So it's finally come. I actually feel somewhat nervous. Don't freak out so much that you screw up, alright? You're the one to talk. I ask you to go easy on me. Well then, see you tomorrow. Hold on a sec. Crow, go over the operation again before you leave. Is it just not as we discussed earlier, is it not? 
This battle will decide our future. We must ensure we're fully prepared beforehand. Very well. Our objective is stealing Saison's treasure. We will meet up at the course at a courthouse at approximately 6 p.m. Good. Want to give us a last word before we do this, leader? Let's go all out. We'll be relying on you. What wonderful trusting relationship. I will do my, my best in this as well. All right. We can't afford any mistakes, especially not this time. Tomorrow's the big day, so let's give it our all. Just curious. I see. What's up? Alright, and this is where I'm going to end off the episode for now. So in the next episode of Persona 5, we'll be taking on Sai Nijima and her palace. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Persona 5. If you guys liked it, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Do what you guys do in that YouTube. Follow me on Twitter at OperationGamer1, all that cool stuff. And I hope you're ready for things to get spicy. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.